Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. This is Shizley Marie. Welcome to my channel, Mystical Solutions. And this time I bring you the reading for the wonderful sign of Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Ascendant, or Venus. Scorpio, we are going to be starting with your reading. We are going to see my spirits. It's not me, but you. Please give me the future for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Ascendant, or Venus. Good luck with the 73. But I feel that the seven archangels and the Holy Spirit, God and Jesus, could potentially be bringing a substantial blessing into your life. And I feel that this blessing might be an earth element person, Capricorn, Virgo, Octavius, who comes to put order in your life, even comes to conduct divine justice for you. This person can be a lawyer, they can be a doctor, it could be even a physician that heals you, and it might be someone that changes your life forever in a loving way. I see you as number 23. I see that you need to take good care of your spine. I see that you might be a little tired or weary of the food issue because you might need to eat healthier than necessary for some kind of problem. Maybe the gallbladder, liver, stomach, or something similar. It could also be that you're not very happy with your weight, and that could be leading you to follow an extreme diet. You might also be forgetting things a lot too, okay? Let's continue with the crystal ball. There will be a curious fact about your windows. It could also be that someone is spying on you very close to your house, listening to what you say. And apart from all this, you might also feel very alone, okay? I see. Apart from all this, through the quartz tip, a new animal that might be coming into your life, here I see that you're also going to miss a pet that you had in the past, okay? Well, let's go ahead. Let's see with the consecrated children. I remind you that your readings for the month of July are already in the channel's playlist. We are going to move forward with the carving paths. I open all your paths. I open the door of your destiny. I open what is blocked so that you can find your happiness and your most desired desires. It is done. If it is, it is already done. Well, another thing I feel is that you could be unblocking some kind of power that you have. You could be having your third eye more open. You could be having more experience or even bringing things more with the mind. Look, you get the snowflake talking about how all seasons are beautiful for your life. And besides all this, well, you should realize that all seasons are beautiful. I see the infinity symbol for you, which is a good thing as it could be opening up a new possibility of success and prosperity. You're also getting the horseshoe indicating that you'll have good luck in games of chance and the tree of life, which means you're going to think about having children if you don't already have them. You're also getting the little red heart that speaks of passion, possibly a new passion that may be entering your life. The white cross speaks of a spiritual blessing that will be bestowed upon you from heaven. The bananas suggest that you might need to eat more fruit. You're also getting the dragonfly. When you see this little creature, you'll know that fortune is near. The pink flower implies that bathing with flowers will bring you money and love. Let's move on to the letters. I remind you that if you hear me on any other platform other than YouTube, you can follow me on my main social network, which is YouTube, and you can find me as Mystical Solutions, Wealth Affirmations, Free Readings, Gains, and Liberating Mystical Prayers. In the reading of your cards, it talks about how you could be thinking about how to make more money. But there is a person who is related to you who can be a daughter or even possibly a mother-in-law who could be thinking about something financial with you, let's suppose. 